Hi, how are you? It's Travis here, and welcome back to our adventures in Azeroth. Last episode, we created our Death Knight, Trap Box. And we went out, and we battled with the Scarlet Crusade. Today, we are going to continue that battle. And I don't think I get my mount until I complete this quest chain here, so... That's what I'm hoping. Not too sure. Here's Gothic the Harvester from uh, Nexramus. Gothic the Harvester. You have fought hard to invade the realm of the Harvester. Wait. Gotha looks at his notes. My apologies, human. Old habits die hard. Valinar send you, then. I trust you are somewhat competent. I do have a gift for the Scarlet Dogs. One that is sure to speed up their work in the mines. I have come from the frozen heart of Naxxramas to feast on souls and deliver a vicious thrashing upon our sworn enemies. And I'm all about souls. This device I am going to give you is a portable plague spreader. Take it east to the Havenshire mine and unleash it near the Scarlet Miners working inside. Use it to turn the miners into ghouls and return to me when you have a small army at your side. I have saved a special place for them in the vacuum cleaner of souls. Looks like we're going to get a soul harvester charm for that. It's a cool little trinket. Let's see how we're doing here. Got a lot of bag space, so we don't have to worry about too much. And we got six gold. So let's make our way to um, the mine here. We have to bestow the gift of the harvester upon the scarlet miners. Not as many DKs out here as there was last episode. But, um... It was fun experiencing that. We have to fight these... these ghosts. And, uh... Yeah, we'll probably never see... I don't know about never, but... It's gonna be rare to see that many DKs... in one spot again. So I'm happy I did it. And I also checked out uh, the fresh server. I made a uh, undead mage. And when I logged in there, it was actually still pretty packed with uh, fresh undead spawns. So I didn't really miss out on that launch either. Oh, we have to return it? So what do we do? We do this? How do we return... Well, we got a... Treatment on. How do you return it? Do we have to do this again? I'm not too sure. We're not really getting any credit for this. I'm clearly doing something wrong. Use it to turn the miners into ghouls. Oh, okay. So I guess uh, our miners are just not turning into ghouls. One thing about a DK is they don't heal. So we're going to need food. Have a bite of this brie here. So I guess if they don't turn into ghouls, we just slay the ghosts. Interested to see uh, if we can make heavy rune cloth bandages. Looks like we can. So we'll make three of those. Throw them on our bars. So I'll put it... Um, put his teeth for now. Won't be that easy, fiend. All right. 
I'm gonna put this on our bars too. I think we'll only fight one at a time though. Not sure how our AoE is. There we go, we got a ghoul, nice. Use it on this guy now. So I guess this is an introduction to Unholy Death Knights, because they, uh, they usually can summon ghouls. There we go, there's another one. Hard to get aggro off of our ghouls. <laughs> Actually, hit pretty hard. Pretty low chance of getting a ghoul off these guys. Ghoul? Nice. Now we got three. Nice, there's another one. We're rolling hot. Need one more. There we go, guys. Let's go. Oh, damn time. We got lucky. This guy says mommy. That's fine. Right, so let's bring these boys back. Get over here. That's is probably one of the coolest abilities that they've ever added in WoW, I think. It's like so useful. In some raids in the game, you literally bring DKs just because they have that ability. Here we go. Here's your ghouls, Gothic the Harvester. Get in that pit before I turn you into a pile of ash. More souls for the blade. They know that the mines are no longer safe. They will double their efforts in retreating, leaving their backs open to us. Only the Scarlet Forces at New Avalon and Light's Point challenge us. The time to attack the Scarlet Fleet at Light's Point has come. The diversion at the mine has caused chaos amidst their ranks. They are frantically working to clear the area and return to their ships. The time is ripe. 
Prince Malinar is seizing this opportunity to finish off the Scarlet Fleet. Report to him at once. All right, let's go report to uh, Valinar. Seems to be the leader of this invasion. The Scarlet Crusade will serve a new master in death. You have served us well, Death Knight. Few of your brethren have survived our initial attack upon the Scarlet Interlopers. You remain as one of the strongest, Prince Valinar nods. East of us, past the Havenshire Mine, is the coast called Light's Point by the Scarlet Crusade. A thousand soldiers stand between us and their ships, insurmountable, hardly the point. In their haste, the Crusade will make one fatal error, forgetting to check the mine cars. You are to return to the Havenshire Mine east of here and locate the mine that my minions have planted near the outhouse. Climb inside the mine car and a Scarlet Miner will unwittingly see to it that you are placed safely behind enemy lines. Once aboard one of their ships, use the cannons against them, slaughter them all. Call the Scourge Griffins from the cannon when you are ready to return. Okay. So it looks like we need to uh, head to a mine that's east of here. Not sure where that... Is that it here? We gotta get into the cart? That is east right there. Alright, let's go. Gotta locate the mine cart that, the, that his minions have planted. Is that it? Doesn't look like it. Minecart they're talking about. Looks like we're back here again. Is it over here? Okay, this is up here. So we're in a dead end. Yeah, I'm not too sure where this is. I think it might be outside. Maybe a little bit more to the east. Can we get into this one? No. Is that it? No. Hmm, okay. There it is. About damn time we found it. Where'd this come from? I better get this down to the ships. Before the foreman sees it. Work, work. Look at this guy. This guy's a hard worker. Like sprinting with this thing. Fifty-six human human elite. Yeah, they wouldn't we wouldn't do too well against these guys.
There we go, we made it. Now what? I'll just leave it here. And nobody will be the wiser. Alright. It's time to shoot. Alright, so we got a couple of abilities here. Scarlet Cannon, a low fuel cost. Makes his mid to long range gun an absolute necessity in the field. Aim low and let it rip. Then we got the electric electromagnetic pulse using this energy of the scarlet cannon a powerful point blank electromagnetic pulse is emitted all enemies in close proximity are obliterated and then we can call down a scourge griffin to bring us back to death's breach all right so let's see how this goes guys wonder if they're going to attack us or not yeah they are What the heck's going on? Getting shot by these guys back here. Let's use one of the electro big. Oh, that's if somebody gets upstairs. Okay, so you just use that if somebody gets on top of the cannon. Well, good thing that's not happening. Okay, we return now. We're having a little bit too much fun here. Scourge has broken through. I also have the chat down here. I don't know if you guys uh, want me to pull it up. I don't think it ruined. It's uh, I usually have it up here, anyways. It really, just tells us like what people are saying and what we looted, quests we're on. Something like that. No, it's not, no, like, chat or anything. Nothing's too spammy. Can't wait till we get our mount. I wonder what type of mount it is. I wonder if it's like a 150 speed mount. Maybe it is. <laughs> Entire Scarlet Fleet wiped out in a matter of minutes. I will receive a commendation from the Lich King for this. All that remains of the Scarlet Crusade now are the Denizens of New Avalon. I'll set the Firestarters and Necromancers upon Havenshire immediately. He will carry my report to the High Lord. That oh, looks so like we got some bracers. Let's put those bad boys on. Look at that. Victory at Death's Breach. Prince Valinar hands you a sealed scroll. This is the full report of our victory at Death's Breach. You are delivered to deliver this to High Lord Mulgrain. Inside Ocarus, I have made sure to include your heroics in the report. Ograin will undoubtedly reward you greatly for this victory trap box. Go now. Alright, so back to Ocarus we go. I think I was saying it wrong last episode, I was saying Arcarus or Ocarus. I wonder if anybody calls it a churus. <laughs> Could you imagine that's what it's actually called, a churus? There we go, there's Mograin. One of the four horsemen. Obey or be eliminated. I was certain you wouldn't make it back here in one piece, Death Knight. Perhaps there is more to you than I first surmised. All right. High Lord Morgrain reads over the report. The entire Scarlet Fleet. High Lord Morgrain nods. Such power, tra trap box. I have not seen such a display of domination in years since my father wielded. High Lord Morgrain shakes his head. It's not important. Yes, your commendation. Lest I forget. So we're gonna get some legs. Wow, oh, these are beefy legs. 
The will of the Lich King. It is the will of the Lich King that drives us onward, Fox. None are more aware of this than Death Knights. Our very existence is intrinsically tied to this consciousness. Surely you have heard him speak to you, invading your thoughts. Can you hear him now? Perhaps it is too early for you. Mograin closes his eyes and nods to an unseen host. Yes, my lord, it will be done. Trapbox, you are to return to Death's Breach and report to Prince Valinar. The Lich King commands it. By his command. Alright, off to Death's Breach we go. And I'm going to be keeping all of this Ocarus Knight's gear. And, uh... Reason why is because I think it looks really cool. And who knows? Maybe we'll have a uh, transmog in the future. Be able to transmog back to, to this kind of look. All right. Well, the skies are red today. Let's see what happens here. This looks kind of badass. I should take a pick like this. Open your eyes, brothers and sisters. Gaze upon apocalypse. Yeah, this is a big battle we're going into. The sky itself feeds upon the suffering of the conquered. The Scarlet Crusade is powerless to stop us. The corpses of those that try only serve <laughs> to feed our expanding host. <laughs> Scarlet Fleet lies in ruin upon the Sundered Hulk Ghost. This guy kind of reminds me of Kael'thas. Heavenshire is ours. A thousand corpses litter the ground, patiently awaiting rebirth. We strike now at our enemy with the awakened strength of the Scourge. The ghouls have already begun their assault upon New Avalon. Our forces have moved in behind them and taken the Crypt of Remembrance. The attacks upon the gates of the last Scarlet Bastion have begun. Our ghouls are wearing the Crusade's front lines down while we labor to fortify our new forward base, the Crypt of Remembrance. Venture south to the Crypt, which borders New Avalon, and report to my dear brother, Prince Kaliseth. He will be expecting you. Prepare yourself, Trabpox, for you are about to witness the next stage of Scourge Warfare, Domination. Ride now, Death Knight. Alright, we're gonna be riding on something here. Or what do he has to say? Look at what you have done, Death Knight. You have brought glory to the Scourge. Sure have. So we have to report to Prince Keliseth at the Crypt of Remembrance. Really don't know where the heck, where the heck that is. Oh, well, I guess we'll figure that out. Maybe he tells us. Which borders New Avalon. We gotta go south. Probably should have went down that way. But whatever. The heck is that thing? The gluttonous ghost. Bunch of death charges here now. It's over here. Not the plague blinger. Hopefully we're going the right way. It's cool how you get to talk to all of the bosses in Nax. Oh, there it is. The Crypt of Remembrance. Look at the size of this guy. 
It might look like an ordinary pumpkin patch, but once the plague cauldron is placed, it will become a source of disease, rot, and plague. Noth, where is Hygen? That no good kiss up is probably practicing ballet in his chambers. <laughs> I get the unclean. Look at this pumpkin patch. Notice anything missing? Of course you don't. Because you're a moron. Your brain <laughs> was probably the first thing to die. Not size. I have been commanded to put together a plague cauldron. You will help me. Directly inside the gate of New Avalon is the inn. Enter the inn and steal an empty cauldron. Then go to the forge also near the gate and steal some iron chains. Bring those back to me along with ten crusader skulls. Do I need to tell you where to get those two? Okay. Well, we're heading into the crypt. This is the crypt guardian. We'll go to the inn eventually, but we'll, we'll do this quest first. Baron Rivendare, wow. Hail Death Knight, I am the Blood Lord, Kaliseth, ruler of the southeastern reaches of Northrend. The Lich King has sought to utilize my talents in ending this mortal affront to the Scourge. As with all things the Lich King has of me, I am happy to oblige, of course, a sea of endless souls to sate my thirst, certainly sweetened the deal, don't you think? Nowhere to run and nowhere to hide. Nothing less than total annihilation will suffice, Trapbox. To that end, a few hundred mindless ghouls assaulting the front gate of New Avalon will not do. We must infiltrate the inner sanctum and dispose of their officials. They must be shown that no one can escape the Scourge's grasp. Make your way to New Avalon Town Hall, southwest of here, and assassinate the mayor. Search the building for the New Avalon Registry and bring it to me. And we got another quest here from Baron Rivendare. Crusaders, Rivendare shakes his head. I am convinced that they are a unique lot amongst the humans. My theory is that they lack higher brain function. Unable to logically assess a situation and calculate an outcome. One has only to make mention of the light to get them frothing and battle ready. At which point they will rush headlong into any engagement with complete disregard for their own well-being lamps to the slaughter. Most humans would have fled the moment a scourge necropolis took up residence in their airspace. Not the Scarlet Crusade. I must confess, I rather enjoy our exchanges with the Crusade. Through the years, scourge battles against them have resulted in several of the most tragic events in human history. Yet here we stand again, locked in battle. We shan't deny them the pleasures of eternal servitude to the Lynch King. Enter New Avalon and fulfill their death wish. Leave no survivors. Alright, so we got a lot of quests here. So I don't know if we'll do all of these. I love how the guy's name is Mayor Quinby. <laughs> That's hilarious. That's from The Simpsons, I believe. But yeah, this is a uh, an insane like starting story. They really put in a lot of work on Wrath of Lich King, like getting to talk to every single boss and Nax. Like back in the day, when I was playing, I didn't even know who these guys were. Okay, so we're looking for the inn. Maybe it's... Oh, yeah, we gotta go in there. Okay. Already burnt all this stuff down. I wonder if I'm supposed to have my mouth by now, but... Who knows? I look in my bags and my abilities, and I don't have a... Uh, summon Death Charger ability, but who knows? I don't know. Figure it out later. Hopefully I didn't miss out on anything. So what do we have to do? 
Gonna slay citizens. Oh. Come to death, Death Knight. Turk Swiss. Let's have a bite of that. Shot that guy? Heck. <laughs> I guess they are like level 30. Oh, another death bag here. Nice. I wonder how many Death Knights are, like, running around Outland right now. Probably a lot. Alright, so we need to find the inn. That looks like the inn to me. So I'll head in here and we'll see what's going on. I suppose there's, like, a chain in here and a cauldron. Ah! Filthy coward, get it over with. This is brutal. <laughs> the screams. I wonder where the cauldron would be. We're looking for chains. It's probably down in the basement. Bunch of skulls now. We got our cauldron now. We just need to find the iron chains. I believe those are in the in, in the inn, right? We gotta go to the forge. Okay, we need to slay some citizens regardless. So. <laughs> Quite a couple more. And then we just need to fight soldiers after that. Alright, so there's a town registry right there. The forge looks like it's right over here, so we'll head over there first. Looks like we got a soldier here to fight. Who's that guy? Lord Boro. Scarlet Lord. I guess we'll try to stay away from that guy. Okay, where are the chains at? They're there. Alright, so now we just need to fight some soldiers. 
Guess we'll do that on our way to fighting uh, Mayor Quimby. Gotta stay away from that guy. <laughs> Completely wreck us. Spell power increased by 295. Holy fury. I bet when there was like a bunch of DKs here, they were just like all like ransacking him, like 10 DKs all on him. <laughs> I got that off. So I'll eat some cheese. Hornet Greaves of the Monkey. I wonder if those are any good. They don't look too good. I think ours are a lot better. Yeah, see, this guy has his mount. I must have messed up. Maybe we get it after, like, we, like, ransack this town. Oh, we got two more soldiers to go. Let's go see what Mayor Quimby's doing. Kramis is gone, who cares? Akaris is here now, and the Death Knights are killing everybody. There, he looks just like Mayor Quimby. <laughs> it's cool how they did that. It's actually pretty tough. Oh, he's already back. Okay, so we're done those two. Now we just need to fight two more soldiers. Citizen of Avalon, they're all yelling like, Quimby, Quimby. <laughs> What's Crimson Dawn? We deserve to know the truth, Quimby. Scourge are running three free through our streets. Now yeah, everybody's like asking Quimby for help. Where are those ships going, Quimby? Tell us the truth. <laughs> That's actually kind of funny. You can't trust politicians. Alright, so there we go. We finished all of the quests. That was actually pretty damn quick. Should get a decent amount of XP for that. Cool thing about this quest chain, you pretty much go straight to Outland after this. It will probably be 58 by the time this is over. I think we'll go and have a chat with, um, with Noth first. It might, oh yeah, I've read that. Have you gathered the materials I requested? Perfect. Now give me a moment to get things set up. My task is done. There it is. The cauldron is ready to begin spewing its foul corruption across the land. Now, Death Knight, a brief lesson in plague cauldrons. The gas that the cauldron emits is deadly to the living, but empowers Scourge. 
As with all Scourge creations, it feeds off death and grows stronger the longer it feeds. Take these cauldron crusader skulls and drop them in the cauldron. You will be quite happy with the results. Alright, so let's go do this. The play cauldron stands idle. The play cauldron jumps to life when the skulls are placed inside. After a few seconds, some vials of dark liquid float to the top. We got Nos Special Brew. Uses restores 1500 health and 50 rune pa runic power. Wow, that's pretty awesome. Uh, Potion for a death knight. My task is done. It's pretty OP. And this is a daily you can do. Well, I wonder if these will be used in raids. I think death knights will probably want to use that in raids instead of a health bot. She gained fifty runic power and. Health, it's pretty damn good. Increases your damage. Yeah, maybe we'll see uh, Death Knight's farm in this uh, Noth special brew. It's a lot of skulls you gotta farm, though. There is nowhere to run. The registry will tell us many things. I wonder if you can, like, read the registry. No. It was made by me. Supposedly. The registry will tell us many things about the Scarlet's insects. About the Scarlet insects. Kaliseth flips through the pages of the registry. Death rates, births, but most importantly, movement. Look here, trap box. They have already sent their sent three vessels abroad. Let me see where they are headed. Kaliseth mutters something about latitude and longitude under his breath as he calculates the route. What? This is impossible. They sailed in Northrend. Beside the coordinates are the words Crimson Dawn. How to win friends and influence enemies. In my travels across this world, I have made several interesting discoveries. For instance, did you know that with the proper amount of encouragement, one can extract all the truths that a man dares to hide? As luck would have it. I happen to have some encouragement on hand. Kalseth pulls something out of an ordin ornately jeweled box. These are my persuaders. Equip them and take to the field, Death Knight. Apply the pointy ends to the soldiers of New Avalon. Discover the truth about this Crimson Dawn. You are quite effective with that blade trap box. Perhaps Lich King permitting. You would be interested in becoming one of my minions. Stratholm is looking for a new mayor. Alright, so we got some loot. Got this belt that we're going to put on, and we got these boots. Alright. Let's get out of here. <laughs> yeah, pretty funny, these quests. And even the names, like the names are connected to, like... Names of books in real life, TV shows, stuff like that. Okay, Crimson Dawn Refield. So we have to go there and use, uh, open this jewel box. And we got the Persuaders here. I guess we gotta put both of them on. You can dual wield, right? Is it DK? Let's see how this works. We have to go talk to soldiers. Let's see if we can find these guys. Looks like he's on the same quest. I think the keep would have some soldiers. There's one. See what he has to say. I can't keep this up for very long. Scarlet Dog, tell me about the Crimson Dawn. Arg, the pain, the pain. It's almost as unbearable as the lashings. I received in grammar school when I was a child. Tell me what you know about the Crimson Dawn, or the beatings will continue. You'll have to kill me, monster. I'll tell you nothing. 
All right, well, let's keep going through this keep here. I'm through being courteous with your kind human. What is the Crimson Dawn? You'll get nothing and I and like it. <laughs> I'm through with being courteous. Okay, it's the same thing. For the grammar school line. I'm sorry he's gonna say anything. It looks like this guy's just gonna He's not snitching. saying anything. Let's actually do a lot of damage. Soldiers were tra trained well. Not tell me a damn thing. That one tickled. <laughs> that guy's a new line. Let's keep going. We'll find somebody who'll talk. We got two now. Tell you everything. Stop, please. We we have only been told that the Crimson Dawn is awakening. You, you see, the light speaks to the High General. It is the light, the light that guides us. This movement was set in motion before you came. We, we do as we are told. It is what must be done. Crimson Dawn, what is it? Speak. We yeah, hit like a girl. I know very little. Yeah, it looks like the, the secret has been revealed. They speak to the light. Light tells them what to do. I guess the Scourge don't know about the light because of the nut that they didn't really go to Outland. And they've never probably seen the Naru before. I wonder if the Alliance told the Scarlet Crusade about the Naru or if they had encounters with the Draenei. Maybe they would, you know. I don't know, not be as hostile to everybody. <laughs> but who knows. Alright, we're going back down. An awakening. What nonsense do you speak, boy? What kind of fool would deliver their people into the very heart of the frozen wastes? Perhaps, though, this courier holds the answer. Nice, we got a new ring. I have sent Orbaz, Thessarian, and Kultira behind enemy lines to search for the courier. They have set up a base operation at the Scarlet Tavern, located at the southern end of New Avalon. The tavern is tucked away behind the two orchards, adjacent to the chapel of the Crimson Flame. You are to make your way to the tavern and report to Orbaz Bloodbane. He will update you on their situation. Alright. So let's get out of here. Looks like we gotta keep on going south. Southern end of New Avalon. Tavern is tucked behind the two orchards adjacent to the chapel with the Crimson Flame. Alright, so we'll head directly south. We'll see what we find. So we're gonna have to put a sword on because uh, we lost our other items. We got this trinket. Let's equip that as well. 
Oh, this finger is looks a lot better than the other one we have. I think everything else will keep. Oh. Getting a little deep. I wonder if we'll be able to handle these guys. Pretty strong. We got more of these like writings. Turning the other cheek. Pretty much just has like a bunch of uh, like doctrine, like Scarlet Creature say doctrine that people hold on to. And we don't have. Oh yeah, we got some food here. We'll have a bite to eat. Topic of indulgence. Is a difficult one, but at times in our lives it becomes a necessary evil. A lapse of judgment, a harsh word too quickly spoken. A punch or kick thrown in anger. All these things are failings of mortal men. And the church must acknowledge that. However, such acknowledgement does not come without a price. For sins of harsh words, a mere handful of silver will cleanse the soul for sins of physical force. A handful of gold... I think we read this. Yeah, we, I think we got rid of it. What's this one? I think we read this one. Purify the body with labor. Purify the soul with prayer. Purify your enemies with fire. Pain is not an enemy, but an ally to be embraced. Held close and delivered to unbeliever and believer alike. Resistance to the ways of the light as a sign of impurity. It should be excised from the flesh of the community. Alright, so there's the chapel there. So we're in the right spot. Who are these guys? You're not welcome in these lands, monster. That guy's not an elite. No, he's coming. He's protecting me. He's protecting me whoever lives here. I'm starting to hit really hard now with all the sleep we got. You like your betters. I wonder if that's a new one. It's a new one. Who's this guy? Orbaz Bloodbane. Speak your peace. We are the chosen ones, Trapbox, Death Knights of the Scourge, sent to sow seeds of the Master's destruction. Looks like we'll let anyone into the Dark Orders these days. When I was given the gift, things were different, much different. As to this courier, the path of the Righteous Crusader. We haven't got a damn clue about when or where the, this courier is supposed to show up. None of these humans had an answer either. Orbaz points to the scarlet corpses strewn across the floor. I did manage to beat something useful out of the last one. Inside Scarlet Hold, they keep a schedule of all patrol routes. I want you to break into the hold and steal that schedule. The hold is the largest building in New Avalon, northeast of here. All right. We will ravage this land. We got another quest what? here. Brothers in Death, breaking through the Scarlet, scarlet Crusade's lines was no easy task. We suffered many casualties during the assault and lost one of our best death knights, Kotira Deathweaver. I don't know wh whether he's dead or alive, but I'll be damned if we don't search for him. I last saw him being bound in irons and dragged away to the Scarlet Hole north, north of here. Tear that keep asunder, death knight. Find Kotira. We will ravage this land. You know, they completely wrecked everybody in this room. Why do you care? His weakness led to his capture. Only the strong should survive. What, Orbaz? That he's a blood elf? 
You're not welcome in these lands, monster. We got somebody chasing us. So I think, uh, yeah, they're not too happy with, um... With the Blood Elf that, uh... I guess... Made the plans to... About this invasion. I guess those guys think it was a failure. Too many losses. And they are, uh... Not too happy with them. It's 16 unspent talents, guys. Increases the range of your icy touch. Increases the frost shadow damage. Yeah, we'll use that. Nerves of cold steel. Increases your chance to hit with one hand and melee weapons by 1%. Increases your... I don't know if we're gonna... I think you eventually use one, Andrews, don't you? As a, as a frost DK? I've always known that to be a thing. Draw upon your unholy energy. I guess we're going to be using this. You leech heat from your victims of your frost fever so that when their melee attacks, speed is reduced. Yours is increased by 4%. Yeah, we'll probably get that. And then we got Lichborn. Draw upon unholy energy to become undead for 10 seconds. While undead, you're immune. So it's kind of like a PvP thing. Increases your critical strike chance to your melee special ability by one. It's 30% that your obliterate will do. That's pretty good. Your melee attacks have a chance to make your next icy touch howling crit. Yeah, that's pretty good. Killing machine. There we go. Hopefully we pick some good stuff. So we gotta go over here. The tears hand. I believe. But yeah, they're not too happy with that, uh, that Blood Elf. But he did a good job. Like, if he, if he knew, like, like, what we did, like, getting behind enemy lines and then playing, like, a hundred Scarlet Crusade members, it's a lot. And that was all his idea. But if that idea flopped, I guess they might have lost. They would have lost this battle and uh, Acherus would have been uh, destroyed. Alright, so this looks like the spot. Well, I can't believe we're here. In Classic, this place is, like, full of, like, high-level elites. I've actually never been in here before. Or well, I have, and I've totally forgot. So there's nothing in here. This isn't the Scarlet Hole, is it? Maybe that's the hold here. I think this whole area is called the Scarlet Hold. The other one he wants us to uh, find the new Avalon troll schedule. And where will we find these patrol routes? So I guess not in here. These places are completely empty. Could have went a little too far, maybe. Maybe that was it there? It's like nobody in here, so it's making me believe there's this is uh it went the wrong way. Kind of lame how there's like nobody in here. Well, I guess they all left, right? They went to Northern. That's what happened. Yeah. Okay, so we went to the wrong place. Holds up top here. This is my bad. It's cool to check this spot out one last time. But yeah, if the... One thing you can say about, you know, Scarlet Crusade, they did know that the, the Lich King was a threat. 
and he took them pretty damn seriously. It's just they were pretty much as crazy as Arthas was <laughs> about the, uh, the threat of the Scourge. I think that was their main problem. So that's probably it right up there. I assume we'll probably find Kultira in the in the cellar. Yeah, they're getting wrecked now. Ever since we upgraded our talents. I totally forgot about that. It's crazy the amount of talents you get while you level up as a, as a death knight. You get a lot. Some people are leveling up really fast. Got, I've seen uh, a couple of Death Knights are already in like the high 60s. Like flying. Flying through TBC. So I guess uh, TBC's you know, level requirement's probably down. Like per level, it's probably really, really fast. This month's a great time to level. Oh, there we go. Others in death. Just to get ready for, uh, for wrath. down here Our master's will oh this is who they were talking about I'm badly injured and I'll do what I can to, tr to help try and stay inside my anti-magic barrier what the heck my anti-magic barrier for the acolytes magic will tear you apart <laughs> he died wow that sucks now I have to wait. That's all good. Maybe we'll go get the patrol schedule. What this guy wants to do. He's got to fight these guys. This is where you get it. Oh, it's in here. I didn't get to turn in the quest. I think he's trolling me. How would the patrol schedule be in the cellar? Oh, there he is. Get on with it. You were foolish in coming after me. I failed. Should have been left for dead. Now the two of us might be killed. Kotira shakes his head. We are Death Knights of the Scourge. This flies in the face of the Dark Brotherhood's covenants. Thessarian, you fool bastard. Bloody breakout. Just we'll pick that up. Pick up Bloody Breakout yes. here. We'll check it out. The alarms have been sounded. The High Inquisitor and his acolytes will be here soon. I'm too badly injured to be of much use, but I'll do what little I can to help. Slay the High Inquisitor and his cronies, tear off his head, and return with it to Thessarian's Thessarian. Vengeance will soothe his savage soul. One more thing, Trabpox, if you do manage to survive and make it back to 
necessary and tell him that they are executing prisoners at the chapel. Perhaps he'll send you there to pay, play the hero once more. I will listen for now. There's another cool thing about Death Knights is their anti-magic barrier, anti-magic shell. We got some new talents here. I've got two, so I guess we'll bet in the killing machine. For some reason we can't kill this guy. There we go. My Inquisitor comes, be ready, Death Knight. Do not let him draw you out of the protective bounds of my anti-magic field. Does he actually do that much damage in here? Oh, he's inside. I tried to grip him. Though. This is going to be a humbling defeat. The death of the High Inquisitor. Of New Avalon will not go unnoticed. You need to get out of here at once. Go before more of them show up. I'll be fine on my own. I'll draw their fire. You make your escape behind me. Alright, here he is. Let's run with them. Your High Inquisitor is nothing more than a pile of meat, Crusaders. There are none beyond the grasp of the Scourge. Okay, well, we're not getting the, the schedule here. So we gotta go upstairs. I'm ask this guy how he got his mount. I probably missed out on it. Quest? Should be an ability, right? I should have gotten it. Well, maybe it's in my bag and I just haven't seen it. Like, what the heck? Maybe I just didn't do the quest. I'll we'll figure that out. Eventually. There's the patrol schedule. Oh, open character screen and click pet at the bottom. Hilarious. What the heck? Thanks, dude. Had it the whole time. <laughs> Forgot about that. I, will, I didn't really forget about it, but... Yeah, that's a Wrath of Lich King thing. Yeah, nice guy. Hooked me up. Now we got a mount, finally. Running around like a... Like an imbecile. Didn't know that would be under pets. That's so weird. How's it a pet? It's a mount. Well, maybe. I guess it's a pet. Let's do this. Well, it's 100 speed. Not bad. So we're going to have to pay a little bit of gold to get a little bit faster mount. Damn, it's about damn time we found this thing. Sorry, guys, if you were like, you know... Cringing, saying like, hey man, it's in your pet bar. This guy's so dumb. <laughs> but hey, we, we found it, man. Figured, well, we didn't figure it out. We got some help, but... I think we asked. At least we figured it out on episode 2. Could you imagine I'm on, like, episode 20? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> that would have been hilarious. Why'd this guy go bro? Where do you get that mount? 
Yeah, so I'm not the only one. See? I'm not the only one. Character. Character. Yeah, no one knows it's there. Like, it's just, it's... It's, it's a Wrath of Lich King thing. What of Kultira? I'll feed this monster's head to the ghouls. Sarian tosses the head into the back room. Did Kultira make it out? There, Sarian pauses. I'm certain he did. Those walls can't hold him. Time for some payback. Suffer well. Let's turn this bad boy. Tear the hold apart. The schedule is there. Orbas flips through the schedule. These worthless credents have been busy. Northern patrol routes, southern patrol routes, western patrol routes, eastern patrol routes, but nothing about their couriers. Routes. Wait a minute. What's this? It looks like a western patrol route coming out of the western plague lands. This patrol will path through here today. I'm going to need time to plan. Ashes to ashes. Let's put that chest on. These hands on. Hopefully that helped them. Okay. Yep, hope it did. You know what, guys? This episode's been over an hour. So we're going to call it here. And next episode, hopefully, we can finish this uh, DK prologue. But as always, thanks for watching. Keep your heads up. Later. Later.